Mineral Virginia is more than 430 miles away from Cleveland. Despite this incredible distance, vibrations from Tuesday's earthquake could be felt all across Northeast Ohio. I always find this stuff very amazing that it travels that far. Um, typing away on the computer and everything started to shake and it was like, what is that? Just before 2 o'clock in the afternoon, a 5.8 magnitude quake erupts on the East Coast. Soon, the walls at Herb's Tavern in Rocky River started shaking. I knew it was an earthquake. I know what trucks feel like when they go by and the chair was moving and I looked at the walls, all the pictures were moving. I was at the Panera in Center Ridge Road in Rocky River. My chair felt like it was bending and wobbling, just back and forth real quick. The needle was going so fast that it le left just a very faint signal. Clyde Simpson is the observatory coordinator at the Cleveland Museum of Natural History. He says the last major quake to hit Northeast Ohio was back in January of 1986. That was a magnitude 5.0. And typically, if you go up by one full magnitude, you're talking around 10 times more powerful. Actually, the fact that we can feel it here at all is a, is a little bit surprising to me. Jim Van Norman teaches geology at Case Western Reserve University. He says the intensity of this earthquake reached farther than usual. As for why? It's a fairly shallow earthquake that tends to make the vibrations bigger. It's not a very common place to get earthquakes. They're about as common as they are around here. Um, so, yeah, a little surprising.